Hi everyone, this is Ting from 1475. Uh, I'm very happy to be here to bring you the presentation about Bitcoin ecological development after hyperdrive upgrading. Okay, so let's see the network power growth first. Uh, from June to August, um, we see consistent uh, growth uh, on the network power and the growth rate uh, is still accelerating. This is pretty cool. And how about the base fee? We can figure out that um, base fee dropped um, greatly and it remained stable within limited space after the, after the hyperdrive upgrade. And there are three main reasons. Firstly, the time limit between pre-commit and the pre-commit uh, messages has been adjusted from one day to 30 days. So miners no longer hurry to send the pre-commit messages after pre-commit ones. Um, secondly, pre-commits and pre-commits can be benched into one message, uh, which compresses the gas used required uh, for, for selling sectors. The third reason is, Proof commit aggregate messages has added an aggregation fee. So in the economic uh, sense, the base gas fee is locked in the certain range of about um, 0.13 nanofare to 0.2 nanofare. I will show the details later. Okay, so let's move to um, FF FIP8 pre-commit sector bench effect on reducing gas. So from my from our calculation, the pre the pre the pre bench up upper limit of packed sectors number is up to uh, the maximum is two hundred and fifty six, and the pre bench efficiency of reducing gas uh, is is from five times to 18 times. As for the FIP 13, the proof commit aggregates messengers. Um, if we take a 10 pentabyte node for an example, um, we assume it, um, its sector size is 64 gigabyte. Um, we, can see in, we can see the trust that the gas rate so get the efficiency of gas reduction and the base gas fee break-even point are both depends on the number of proofs benched. The more the more uh, the more proofs you benched, um, some uh, the, the more efficiency um, you can reduce your gas. And um, everything is uh, the difference is. It's tiny uh, if 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 your um, if if your sector size is thirty two gigabyte. Okay, so next I will show you the network maximum capacity of the Bitcoin uh, network after the uh, hyperdrive. As we can see, um, there as um. Since each chip site contains an average of five blocks, and the gas limit of each block is ten billion, um, the, the target gas limit of the whole network is seventy-two trillion. And for now, uh, the gas use is about uh, fifty trillion a day. So there are, um, it means that only seventy percent of the gas limit has been used. So that is to say, we have two potentials to um, to speed our uh, network capacity. So one is more miners using pre-bench proof aggregate messages to see uh, sectors. The second is the increase of gas used on the network. Okay, uh, I will do a simple calculation. If assume that Everyone use a uh, sector size of 64 gigabyte. Um, we, can, we can see that, we can see the sing single sector um, pre commit gas here, about um, 200, two, two minutes, excuse me. Um, we can see the single sector pre commit gas here, about 
uh, about one million. So we add we add them up. We can have the whole gas for single sector selling is a, about um, three million. So, uh, so um, the, the maximum number of sectors sold in a single day for the entire network can be up to nine million, which means that the maximum daily network power growth. Uh, is up to 573 um, pen pentabyte, which is very amazing. Cool. So to conclude, the hyperdrive upgrade is based on the uh, optimization of the code of zero knowledge proof, which not only um, greatly reduces the gas use for sector selling, but also significantly lowers the uh, base gas fee without changing the block gas limit. In a word, it has made great achievement in cutting down both quantity and price of gas. So the gas saving of providing distributed storage services on the Filecoin network is one step of significant improvement. We believe that the Filecoin network is on the road to real data expansion Retrieval mining, smart contracts, and a decentralized storage network for the most important information on the earth. Okay, so as for 1475 uh, team, we have we have been dedicated to uh, the construction of Filecoin eco ecosystem for a long time. Um, for a long time. We were honored to be one of the not raised at the first group, and we have approved 15 clients with a total of 100 terabytes real data. And in May, in, and in May 2021, we, 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 was, uh, we, we were granted one pentabyte quarter and was re-elected as the notary in China again. In addition, uh, um, 1475 team published real data related FIP 16. Uh, for now, CC sectors can only seal garbage data and fail to up upload real data. But through this FIP, it avoids the waste of storage space as so as to improve storage resources utilization. We subsequently with subsequent uh, proposals in the future, it can even convert the CC sectors with real data into verified their uh, sector, so that um, so that uh, the sector can enjoy ten times of um, power. That's a it's a huge improvement. Okay. Thumbs up. Uh, thank you for listening. If you have any questions, uh, you can scan the QR code of WeChat to talk with me after the meeting. Cool. Thank you.